welcome back to Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, uh, not Breath of the Wild, Tears of the Kingdom Shrine Tutorials. Today we're going to be doing this shrine here, which is on the actual floating mass of Hyrule Castle. It's called the Seru Tabumak Shrine. Don't know why that didn't pop up with its fancy green lettering like it usually does. There it is, Seru Tabumak. So like I said, this is actually on the floating mass of Hyrule Castle. Um, so if you want to get up there, you're going to have to do a sky tower nonsense. All right, this one's entitled The Way Up, and it's going to require a lot of Ultra Hand and Ascension. So get ready for that. I'm just going to stand here for a second. Don't worry about it. There I go. All right, so... First things first, you're going to want to grab that platform that's sitting right there. Not with the camera, the ultra hand. There we go. You're going to lift that up, and you're going to put it on top of those two bars. There we go. Once you do that, you're going to switch to ascension, and you're going to just glide up through there. Awesome. All right. After that, you're going to see a couple more platforms to your left. You're going to want to grab those, and we're going to be putting them on that bar. Oops, switch back to Ultrahand. There we go. So for this one, to make sure that the, the platform will stay, we're going to rotate it. There we go. And attach it in an L shape. This way the platform won't fall off the bar. There we go. Now you can ascend through the panel again. Oh, make sure you're hitting the thing, not the bar. There we go. All right, after we get up there, we just got one more thing to do. However, before we hop up there, we're going to get the treasure chest that's on top of that. To do that, we're going to use Ultra Hand, and we're going to connect all three of the platforms together into one long platform. All right, once they're all connected, you've just made a really long bridge, and it's just long enough to get over that gap. So, um... Walk it over, make sure it's high enough. There we go. Rotate it a little bit. And then you can drop it. And there we go. It's all covering up the spikes. So you can run up there, grab the chest. The chest is a magic rod. Um, I chose to leave it because of what I already had. But if that's something you're into, totally there. After that, for the last part, we're just going to disconnect our different pieces. And we're going to make a special platform. You want to take your big platform, lay it down flat. Grab your little platform, put it at the bottom. And then take another one. And put it on like that. Then you can put the big platform on top of the two bars. And then you can ascend through both of them. Once you're up there, you've finished the shrine. Congratulations. We'll see you next time with another shrine tutorial.